Hi Leo, welcome to your bonus reading. So this is a bonus reading because you are one of the signs that has the most views on the mid-June to mid-July reading. If you've not seen that, please do see it because it's very relevant for now and there's some future prediction in there. Um, the readings that get the most views, likes or comments, or if you're a subscriber, so the next sign I'm doing is actually, I know is a subscriber's um, one of the subscribers top signs um, and although it doesn't have the most views there's always appreciation from this subscriber so most views most likes most comments are going to get the bonus readings um, I don't think my videos are getting pushed out in the algorithm for people to see so if you do like and you resonate with it it'd be amazing if you share like comment subscribe if you're finding the readings resonate with you if my work resonates with you if you want a personal reading, then you can contact me on the e uh, email in the description box below or any of my services. Um, thank you if you're someone who reached out and did part, took part for the energy group healing session that I did on the 7th and 8th. I'd love to hear from you as well. And let's see what we have for you, Leo. So a quick bonus reading, guidance for the next week whenever you see this guidance over the next few days two weeks let's see what we've got for you spirit guides emperor leader uh, aries aries energy four of cups and the four of swords interesting so uh here i feel like you really want to step up in this leadership wherever you are okay um a sort of a leadership role or um you really want to take this sort of path what I'm sensing is there is something that's making you feel dissatisfied and you want to step into this energy, but you're not really sure how to and then you take a step back. That could be because of people that maybe no one else has heard of it or has it or has done it. And it, so you feel like you can't. And that's not true because you are able to embody this and achieve what you're looking to do and um, go forward for. The doubts that you're having, okay, or the overwhelm or the unmotivation is causing the lack of motivation. But I think you actually are, are being guided. Let's get some more cards. page of wands absolutely you've got some great ideas you're ready to take action it's telling you here you, there will be a delivery of abundance whatever you're working on abundance doesn't necessarily just mean financial so whatever area you're working on show them you, you can do it alone right so you might be feeling a bit of lack of confidence but honestly you can step into this and it's going to help you ease where you've been feeling like you're fatigued, you're not motivated, you're lacking appreciation for stuff in life because you can't see a brighter picture. Um, there's a lot around stability and I think, you know, that's good. So you're, you're stable. I think you're also kind of contemplating should you take this move or should you work on something new? Because in honesty, you kind of have the stability you need for life, but you're not that happy. And so it's kind of like, do I just keep going and I don't rock the boat or do I take this chance? And to me, the chance looks amazing. You just need to get out of the lack of motivation. Um, you're going for more. Be the proof that magic happens all the time. The page of swords is here. Some of you have got kids and there's kids around you probably because summer holidays is coming up. Um, but there's definitely also some form of communication that's coming in for you. Five of Pentacles, where you feel maybe a bit alone, isolated, out in the cold. Um, some of you could be having the financial constraints, okay? But look at this. This communication is going to come in and it's going to really pull you into feeling wanted, to being gathered with your family or friends. You might be attending, going out with them more. It's going to put you in a more positive space. Um, it's not a race. It is a marathon. Don't let anyone make you feel like you have to rush into greatness. Um, Queen of Cups is here as well and the star healing. So don't let anyone make you rush into greatness. 
there's a beauty in patience and there's a beauty of being in your heart as you're trying to achieve what you want as well. So that's really what I have for you, Leo. Let's get in and see what other messages we've got for you as well. Joy. I mean, look, it's coming in for you. You can do it. You can do whatever you want. You can achieve, even if it's going after the person you want or the person coming to you, whatever it is you want, you can do it. Recovery. You're going to be recovering from where you've um, felt unmotivated, dissatisfied, out in the cold, isolated by people. Some of you, I feel like you might have gone through where you've been feeling a bit ill and unwell with these two cards. Um, but you are definitely, and there was a star healing card at the bottom of the deck. So some of you have maybe not been feeling very well health wise, maybe injury, and there's recovery here. So if you've been looking for that question or wondering if that's coming through, you have it. And funny enough, I feel like there's a spirit guide with you as well, and you are being guided. Perception. Remember what I said, you're having a perception of maybe what people are saying, what people are doing, a perception that you should stay where you are because it's too much of a risk. You want to be in a different place, but um, you're seeing things from a your current point of view. So perception and getting like the Queen of Cups centered in your heart when you feel out of balance. Um, the bottom deck is service, where you're able to give to others. Um, and help others it's going to be uh, it's just a message there that is going to be highly appreciated and I feel like it will be given back to you let's just take a card from here split in the deck man holding the coin again ace of pentacles man holding a coin whatever you're asking yes it's worth it um, if you're asking will you will you move into but more of financial abundance will it be balancing out for you yes it's worth it if you're asking is there going to be a divine counterpart coming in for you yes with possible other possibilities as well two and four is 24 breaking down to a six it could be a soulmate as well so some great messages one more message for you leo We've got Yvonne here who's telling you, you have special bonds with animals. Your pets on earth and in heaven are watched over by angels. And so this is maybe also the spirit guide that I've been picking up on for you. So Leo, I hope you enjoyed your bonus reading. Um, as always, any, any appreciation to the channel um, would be uh, appreciated to help sort of get the videos out there to... I'm not really sure what's happening with the algorithm, but um, it is what it is, isn't it? I hope you have a lovely day and I will see you in your next video. Bye for now.